Good. Hi everybody, we're here back at River Oaks Chiropractic Clinic in Fort Worth, Texas. We have been here for over 40 years now. Technically, Dr. White's been here for just about 43 years. I grew up in this building, but I've been working here for almost a decade. Uh, but I feel like I've been here the whole time with him just because that's the way life goes. Um, got Sam Randolph here with us today. He is a patient of ours. He's a teaching pro at Mirror Vista Country Club here in Fort Worth. And he's come to us and you've had several of your uh, golf pro golfers up there at the club that you've seen benefit from getting chiropractic care, able to get through the swing, um, able to move better to hit the ball the way you should instead of having to modify the swing to be able to, uh, to get through the ball and hit the ball. For you golfers out there, y'all know how important it is to be able to hit the ball well. Uh, straight and hopefully a little bit a little bit longer than normal um, and not hurt doing it and not hurt doing it exactly and so what we've been doing with with Sam here is we've been working on his low back and his pelvis and I'm gonna let him tell you all more about that then we're gonna get him adjusted yeah I've had some chronic issues for lots of years with my SI joint on the right side and a torn labrum there I've avoided doing any surgeries and I've always tried to rehab and stretch and had some success with that but mm -hmm. it works a lot better if I get adjusted first and get the joints put into place first and then go about my exercises and stretching and strengthening and y'all you know, giving me some real good exercises here too to help get those joints to stabilize and strengthen up again and yeah. I definitely been able to move a little bit better a, a physical therapist that worked with me for years saw me swing earlier this year and noticed I was moving a little bit better when I was definitely. feeling good. And definitely. I still have to keep up with my exercises and, and come in and get adjusted here. You know, I can't just avoid that and think I'm fixed forever. <laughs> Gotta keep moving. What happens is we create bad habits during life. And I mean, everybody does. It doesn't matter if you're a pro golfer, uh, a chiropractor, a dentist, a teacher, just a manual labor, anything. There's certain habits that we create over the years cause joints to get jammed up and not move the way they're supposed to. And that's something that golfers all have a tendency of doing. Yeah, and we're always doing things on the same side. I've always known it's helpful for me to go left-handed and even it off, I just don't do it as just much don't. as I should. That's okay, no, nobody's judging you, Sam. <laughs> uh, but what we got going today is we're gonna get Sam adjusted. Uh, Dr. Val's behind the camera right now. She and I have both been kind of uh, co-treating Sam uh, because just like any profession, everybody's a little bit more specialized with what they do and we work together as a team to help get our patients well. So let's get you laying on the table, go ahead and face down. Yeah, y'all can really feel what's going on, like body whispers. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna start down here, just gonna palpate, feel what's going on. A Little bit of muscle tension more on the left side, pretty typical of golfers. We got Dr. Val backed into a corner so she can see what's happening. Start right up here in the upper thoracics, work down through the mids and lowers. Okay. A little bit of drop table action going. And then over here to that right SI joint. The table definitely helps. Yeah, makes it more comfortable, right? Yeah. Okay. Now, as Sam mentioned earlier, they have a tendency to do stuff all one sided. So, all the way up his left side, even through here. It's definitely more tense all the way up his left side. Let's get you roll over on your back, look up at the ceiling. I'm gonna adjust his neck right here. Land on the table, get a little lateral flexion in there. Get over here to the other side. There we go. I used to be a little afraid of that, but if I just let go, it works easy. <laughs> it works easy. All right, we're gonna hand off the phone. Dr. Val's gonna get so in. I'm gonna check your hips, okay? <laughs> Okay. And like our usual disclaimer, don't try this if you're not licensed, okay? This is for <laughs> us who have been properly trained and know how to do this and how to evaluate and treat. Sam, I'm going to check your hips. I'm going to push up. You let me know if there's any discomfort. Just a little. A little bit going up. How about going down? No. Okay. On this side? No. Going down, no. So Sam's pelvis is off a little bit. This left side is higher. He gets pain if we push up. Yeah. We're going to work to balance that pelvis out, so I'm going to use the table, okay? I'm going to come around to the other side. Good. That's better. Now if I push up, pay your discomfort. That's better there. Okay. Yeah, 
my groin was definitely feeling it trying to play golf like yesterday and the day before. Okay. That's better. Yeah, moving much better. You got a good bruise on your leg. Yeah, well, <laughs> camping issue. There's always a story, right? Oh yeah. All right, Sam, roll over under your side facing me. There you go, drop your legs off the table and sit up. And we're all done. Okay. Yeah, we got your pelvis balance. If you want to stand up and try a practice swing, see if you feel like you're getting locked up anywhere. Oh, I can already feel better there. Yeah, there we go. Because when it gets locked up, it's hard for me to turn this way or especially to go like that. The initiation of the follow. So I get afraid to move at it, right? Yeah. Versus if it can, then I go, yeehaw. <laughs> like last summer when we worked on me for a little while and then I won that tournament, it definitely was helpful. Good. Well, thanks again for coming in, Sam. Thank you very much. Thank you Appreciate for watching.